Welcome to Lock and Load. We are at Impact Guns today, one of four stores. And Clark tells us he has something hard to hold today. Let's go take a look at it. All right. Lock and Load. The ultimate gun show where our First and Second Amendment rights intersect. With Brandy Vega. Who's your mama? And Andy Waits. Woo! And the real firearms expert, Clark Aposhian. Andy, how are you? Doing Good. great, man. How about you? Oh, I'm doing okay for a kid. All right, you know what? I told Brandy that you were going to bring some real beef today. She says she can handle anything. What do you have for us? I did bring something really good. Yeah, what do you I have? I can't guys? handle anything. <laughs> All right. This is the Desert Eagle 50 caliber. Well, that sounds sweet, a Desert Eagle. Yeah, I got you. 50 caliber, not so sweet. Yeah. Maybe. This is over Holy five cow. pounds of steel. Oh, God. That's how much my first child weighed. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I could, I could have birthed to, this guy. So you're used, to, you're used to holding something like <laughs> yeah. that. Seven rounds in the magazine, one round in the uh, chamber. Mm -hmm. Gives you eight rounds or 50 caliber, eight of them four inches across. Four inches <laughs> That'll put a big hole in something. Exactly. So what is this mainly used for? Shooting 300 grains of lead at about 1,500 feet per second. Doggone. That's it. That's yeah, going to stop mean, pretty much anything coming at you. Exactly. Yeah. But this thing being so big, so heavy, you're not going to have some gangbanger putting this in his, in his waistband. C certainly not, because uh, for a few reasons. Tell me if you want to carry that around. <laughs> well, let's see. Maybe. No, not That's so a, much. This is a show gun. It is a show gun. Just the mere fact that you've got this thing out in the open on your hip is going to be the deterrent. You're never going to have to use it. It's been used in a lot of movies. Arnold Schwarzenegger uses it. Bruce Willis uses it. Did Charlie's Angels use it? No. I don't know if they could have held that one up. I could have. So we have a couple of <laughs> slots in the top here. What would that be for? You can use an optic, um, a scope. Okay. Wow. Even the bullets are heavy. 300 grains. Um, as opposed to, let's say, uh, 45, one of the big boys on the block, is only 230 grand. Would this go through a bulletproof vest? Because of the velocity, yes. What do you say we take that out? Oh, and, and go, go shoot, shoot some, some stuff. stuff. All right, Clark, we're going to shoot a big gun today, the Desert Eagle 50 caliber, and that sounds very big to us. So we got some extra uh, ammunition here to take a look at what the size is. We have 22 caliber here. This is, what, 9 millimeter? Yes. Okay, 40 caliber. This is 45 caliber. It's bigger than that. What do we have? We're shooting. Oh, God. Dang. Look at that. It's All a right. monolith. This is half an inch from side to side. You going to show us how this works? I will show you how that All works. All right. I think when we purchase these, they're running about $2 a round now. Oh, wow. Yikes. This is a big chamber, as you can see. God, hey, look at that. It looks like, uh, looks like a tunnel. Telescope. Yeah. Grip is very important yes. to managing the recoil. So you're going to make sure that the web of your hand is up as high as possible. Okay. As high as possible. Keep your finger off the trigger. And then what we're going to do is we're going to insert our other hand right like this. Keep that hand wrapped around and then thumbs down. Gotcha. Keep okay. off the bottom. We don't want that grip on the bottom at all. And you're going to push with your strong hand. I'm right-handed, so my strong hand, shooting push. hand, is going to push into my support hand. My support hand is going to push back onto my... So it's an isometric grip. Wow! Look at that! <laughs> and there we go. All we ask is that you hit dead center into the orange, just like that. That's yeah. all. That's it, huh? That's all it's we so, ask. so easy. Simple. I don't know if I can lift it. I'm Did consistent. Right to it. Woo, it does right. kick, I'll tell you that. Have That's fun not what she wanted to hear. You're going to go ahead and grab the gun. Okay. Hang on, I'm doing some, like, Mary's and... Now, I think you're going to be extra safe because she has two pairs of shooting glasses on. <laughs> I do? Yeah, yeah. what on top of your head. <laughs> you're extra safe. Slowly press the trigger. Pushing and pulling, pushing and pulling. Oh. Straight. And finger straight. Cease fire and place that. All right. Perfect. Nice. That was fun. <laughs> That's about the size of a lipstick. I know. It is about that size. 
Wow, that has some power. It really does, kid. Oh my gosh. That's something else. All right, we've seen what the Desert Eagle will do downrange to a target. It's amazing. Now let's go put a cap in it. There you go. All right, here goes the laptop. Woo! Wow. What will this do to a melon? Devastated yeah. to a melon. Really? I say it bounces right off. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Two for the price of one. You got black right here on your face. <laughs> That's where the shell hit. The empty shell casing. That's good. I think you keep it there. This rocks. <laughs> <laughs> That's the way it's done. Nice. There's some fruit salad out there. That's exactly what I was thinking. Wow, you got it on my glasses I'm from telling here. You, it went well, everywhere. this is why I wanted to put that target a ways down range because I knew what would happen. <laughs> <laughs> wow, good shot. That good was shot. a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. That was fun. fun. Whew. You know, fellas, I have shot a lot of guns in my life. Nothing quite like that. Take a look at some of the damage. Look at the bottle. Look at, that look at this. Look at just ripped it right in half. Just tore it right up the middle. There's hardly anything left of that. There's no hole. You want to see a hole, though? Take a look at the laptop. I could put my pinky finger through the screen right now. There's the exit wound on, on the laptop. I think it's over. Take that Microsoft. Close that book, would you? All right, we've seen what the Desert Eagle can do. What are we going to feature next time, Clark? Next week, tactical shotguns in 12 gauge. Woo! Man. All right, go to our website. It is lockandloadshow.com, and you can see all kinds of outtakes and have a lot of fun there as well. Yeah, we'll see you next time. <laughs> Take that.